Good evening, YouTube Pipe community. Andrew here, AKA Bluefin Piper, coming to you from beautiful New Jersey. And tonight, I'm gonna make a quick VR for Wharf Valley Boy. Wharf Valley Boy hit his 500 sub mark and is uh, asking folks to do a VR uh, and talk about their, uh, their plans for summer tobacco. And uh, he's got a very generous giveaway he's doing on his, uh, on his site. So I uh, just recently uh, subscribed to Wharf Valley Boy. I found him through Backwoods Piper and I uh, was looking through his sites. Got some really uh, good, good videos up and especially one uh, I was watching last night that I thought was really interesting as he's uh, opening a 10-year-old uh, tin of Captain Earl's private stock. Uh, definitely one that I would like to have been there to smell the tin note and, and taste because I'm sure that's... Uh, quite uh quite a good uh quite a good smoke after 10 years of aging definitely going to be a while for me before i have any tins with you know with that much age on them i'm as i've mentioned before still you know fairly new to pipe smoking and still growing my cellar and definitely don't have any 10 year old tins anytime soon so i'm sure that was a, a great experience uh for him well, yeah, so uh, Wharf Valley Boy was asking folks to talk about what pipe tobacco they plan on smoking this summer. And for me, I do have a few that I have on the list, uh, a few GLPs blends. Uh, and so for me, GLPs, I've been really enjoying GLPs. And let's see, to start, I've got the Virginia Cream, which I have actually smoked uh, already a little bit, and I've really been enjoying Virginia Cream. I think that's going to be a nice summer blend. It's kind of based on the mix of uh, sweetness in Virginia. Also, uh, Quiet Nights, GLP's Quiet Nights. I've been a big fan of Maltese Falcon. I have not had a chance to try Quiet Nights and definitely plan on doing that this summer. All right, and then finally from GLP's, I'm going to be trying the Union Square, and that's another one that I know folks have been trying. I've seen a, a few posts recently and folks really seem to enjoy it. So I'm looking forward to that, to that Virginia. All right. And, and then I have, I have three tobaccos that I plan on trying this summer that are actually from Milan Tobacconists. And for those of you that are not familiar with, uh, with Milan Tobacconists, a uh, nice retail shop also has a good online business. Uh, I believe they're located in Florida. And I'll post their link to their information uh, in the comments so you guys can, can go take a look for yourself. They have a really nice collection of pipes and their own blended tobacco along with other tobacco as well. And, uh, you know, I initially went to their site because I was looking for folks that carried the Maestro Baraldi pipes. And they have a really nice selection there, uh, very reasonably priced, uh, actually on sale and uh, also got to check out their blended tobaccos and found a few that I wanted to try. So I put in an order recently. Uh, let's see, the first one that I will talk about is their, uh, their Sunset Rum. I don't have the label on this one and I'm not really sure you're gonna be able to see, that, that really helps, right? You're gonna be able to see this really well with the light, there we go. So just obviously an aromatic blend, uh, but a nice rum uh, sweetness uh, flavor to it. So I think that'll be a good summer blend. Also, we've got the uh, Our London Dock, which is uh, just a light English blend that they make that I wanted to, I figured I'd give it a try. All uh, right, and then finally the Milan Balkan blend. So this is, uh, this is their uh, recreation of the famous Balkan Sabrine, uh, old, uh, older Balkan Sabrine blend. And I'm looking forward to trying this. I've seen a few good reviews on it. I don't know if you can really see. I'm gonna try to show their information here as well. Uh, see if I can get the camera to, to focus on that. Uh, not so well, there we go. Okay, and contact info though. Again, I'll put that in the comments section. Uh, so yeah, so those are those are the tobaccos that I'm going to be smoking. I'm sure there'll be a few more added to that list as well. But that's uh, that's my plan for this summer, and just looking forward to some good weather and getting out of this cold late spring and into some warm some summer weather, so we can definitely enjoy more outdoors and more pipe smoking. Hopefully, some good fishing too. 
So you know, that's what I got for you tonight. And thank you again, Wharf Valley Boy, and congratulations on your 500 subs. That's a big mark. I know just started my channel, and I definitely know how hard it is to build up the subscriber base. So I you know, appreciate uh, your posting and videos and, and all uh, everything you've uh, contributed to the YouTube pipe community. So thank you, and have a great night. Take care.